Yo guys, what's up? This is Tom from Unreal Mad and in this tutorial I will show you how to auto-generate LODs in Unreal Engine. So I picked this asset here and we need the LOD picker and the LOD settings. Auto-compute LOD distances is checked, so uncheck it because we don't need that. And I want to have three LODs, so I change the number of LODs from one to three. LOD means basically level of detail. So when you're near the object, you can see more detail. And if you're far away, you can see less detail. And we need to check custom. And you can see our LODs are generated. So let's go into the settings of LOD1 to reduction settings. And you can see person triangles 50%. But I want to set the value to 80. So it's good for me. There's 79% now. That's because you can't split vertices, obviously. And I click on apply changes. And I want this to happen if I zoom out like this. So my current screen size is 0 0.134. And I type it in here. And now we are done for LOD1. We go to LOD2. And for the reduction settings, the person triangles is at 25%. That's okay. But I want this to happen if I zoom out like this. So my current screen size is 0 0.057. And I type it in here. And LOD0 happens if the screen size is 1. So we can close the tabs now. And we are basically done with the LOD settings. So I'm near at the object now and it says LOD0. If I zoom out, you can see LOD1 and how the triangles and vertices decrease. And if I zoom out far away, you can see LOD2. And at this distance, you can't see any changes, but it saves you a lot of performance later in the game. You can save FPS like this. To show it more clearly, I go to LOD2 and set the person triangles maybe to 5 and apply changes still you can see the difference if I zoom out but it saves you a lot of performance so I hope this tutorial helped you if yes leave a thumbs up if no leave a thumbs down I'll see you next time and bye